Hey everybody, welcome to our channel. Uh, my name is Cody, and today we're going to be playing some Outlast. Um, my sister's been playing the original Outlast, so I thought I would uh, go ahead and try the expansion pack, Whistleblower. <clears throat> so let's go and get this started. I look forward to getting scared. I'm just going to go ahead and play on normal. So I'm kind of new to the whole run and hide genre of horror games. What is going on? Where am I? Who's that guy? Sir? Hello? Mr. Blue Man? Other Blue Man? Why am I being strapped to a chair? We don't have to wake up. I don't want to open my eyes, man. I don't... Oh, come on, dude. Really? Somebody hit you? Guy's slapping the shit out of me. Let me help. Oh, 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 oh. Really? 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 Dude, that's just gross. Kind of busy. Now I feel like I got like 10 different STDs in my face or something. Oh. I want to wipe it off. Let me hope. They're not happy about it. And I did a little bit of research on this game, um, just because I'm I was I'm pretty into Outlast from what I've read. You're actually playing as the guy who sent the email to the guy in the first Outlast game, Miles Upshur, the journalist. So it's kind of like we're we're, we're backtracking a little bit. Hopefully, we'll see uh, what went down in Mount Massive Asylum. You don't know me. Have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs, and I can't read the text anymore. Basically, he's saying Murkoff, those guys are a bunch of are a bunch of assholes, and they're harming people, and it needs to be exposed, Edward Snowden style. That is a very well-rendered laptop. Uh-oh, somebody caught me. Oh shit, oh shit. You know, if I was gonna send a cryptic email, or I guess it's not really cryptic, if I was gonna send any sort of email that was exposing the illegal activities of a corporation, I wouldn't do it inside their office or lab. Like, why would you do that? Why not wait till you get home? Why not wait until you leave the country? You know what I mean? Right. Oh, well, don't mind me, just a guy doing his job, not whistleblowing. No, nope, no, nope, just uh. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and sit here and, and do my computer stuff. Tell him he's got 15 cents. Finally. Hello, boss. Functional imaging interfaces and talking to the ASL. We got a patient 30 seconds out and we're blind. Is that the guy that licked me? I don't know. I don't need another performance wow, he's typing so Mr. fast Park that gonna have us up and running his hands aren't pushing the keys down. Right, Mr. Park? God, that guy's a dick. <clears throat> you can't rush technical support. It takes time. Are we happy, Mr. Park? Yes, we're happy. Uh, Steve? Hold on, I gotta type these, this code Park. in real quick. You're dum, doubting dum, our dum, friend, dum, dum, Mr. Wayland Park? Which I consider more than unkind to its programming skill and considerable dedication to the Murkoff Corporation. Oh, dude, it's compiling. The code is compiling. Everything's under control. Damn, that compiler is so slow. Yourself. This is a high security. Not, don't mind me, guys. You Mr. know, just Park a little startled. Surprised. I'm sure he's still calm and eager to finish his work. Take your seat. Oh, quickly, Mr. Park. Ed will need to roll if the fusion monitoring is not active when we put him in the engine. In five seconds. Four. Three. Arterial spin labeling is back on. Oh, oh man. Dude, this shit just looks painful. 
What's going on with his face? You're finished, Mr. Wayland Park. You can leave. Don't expect anything but honesty. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting the hell out of here. You guys are twisted. I'm out. Sure. I quit! I quit! Out of here. Alright, now I gotta get my laptop. I quit! Oh shit. Oh dude. Oh no. On the floor. Oh god. Down. Hands where I can see him. Sorry about the lag guys. It's the game, not the Mr. recording. Park. Consulting contract 8208. Software engineer with a level 3 security clearance. Graduated cum laude from Berkeley, but still somehow not smart enough to realize that the last thing a fly ought to do in a spider's web is wiggle. Somehow dumb enough think that a borrowed laptop, onion router, and firewall patch would be enough dude, to the world's leading I really thought it would work, dude. I'm sorry. Stupid. I stupid. won't tell anyone, just stupid. In fact, that was crazy. Uh what? I'm afraid we're going to have to have oh, you. Oh no. Oh no. Mr. Park, will you willingly I don't want to get tubes shoved in my ass. No. Did you hear that, agent? He said yes, Mr. Blair. Great. Oh, and uh did I just hear Mr. Wayland Park volunteer for oh, no. the Morphogenic Engine program? Oh god, he's gonna put tubes in my ass. Oh. Brave indeed, Wayland. The Murkoff Corporation and the Onward March I don't care about science, just let me leave! And sacrifice. Maybe you could administer Mr. Park here a light. Oh man, he's gonna punch me, isn't he? Oh, oh, really? Oh, ow! Oh man, oh. Yep, it's gonna leave a bruise. Maybe two. Whistleblower. <clears throat> okay. You know, all I can think is I still have that guy spit on my face, and it's really bothering me. Probably explains in the first Outlast game what that is, that black ghost thing. So hopefully it explains it a little bit in this one, because I'm, I'm really at a loss here. I don't really know what's going on. Brought to you by Sony. That turns on night vision. Alright, what's going on here? I don't want to purr! I'm out of here! Fuck you guys, I'm out! I quit! Go! Okay. Bad idea. Wicked 
out of here through reception and then Merc Tactical will pick it up. If they get here in time, we need help now. If we get them on the radio, the National Guard could be here with it. We don't even know the radio works. It's shortwave. If the prison's got electricity, they've got signal, and the lights are on. Merc called us under control. Yeah, I noticed. We need to get to that radio. Outside help doesn't come without outside attention. Stay calm, stay calm. There's no one in the vents. I'm really expecting something to jump out of me, and I just it's really making me tense right now. Um just minding my own business. <laughs> Go back to doing whatever it is you're doing. Didn't get me, black ghost thing. <laughs> okay, where do I go now? Dude, eating him? How did he even kill these people so fast? Literally, how did he kill all these people that fast? Or maybe it was the ghost thing. Ah! Hey, uh, I'm gonna mess with you. I'm gonna mess with that guy. He's gonna totally eat me. Stalking me. Oh my god. Dude, I mean, guys, the tension in this game is ridiculous. Like, really don't want to be cutting up little pieces right now. Really don't want that. Mm. 
Shit! Oh, man, he spotted me. Oh, man. Where do I go? Where do I go? Here we go. Here we go. Go, 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 go! You have stuff on your eyes, man. How do you know if I'm silky? There's the keys. Floors of the facility than to other buildings. Okay, so that makes sense, I guess. Okay, I need to go back to that gated door. I don't really know where to go. Yeah, you, you can stay in there, dude. You, you can tell your secrets to the toilets. Not interested! Shit! Oh, man! He spotted me. Come on, come on, man. Oh, man, I, I reloaded by accident. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ha! Ha-ha! Yes. You stay in there. Okay. This must be the crematorium. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit! Oh. Oh, man. Oh, no. Kinda has that devil's rejects look to him. You stay there and cook. Oh. Oh, okay. Come on, come on, Wailing. Come on. Come on! Come on! Do it! Do it! Oh. No! No! You were mine! No! Never was. Been in there. Church. Well guys, it looks like we are out of time for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed my first playthrough for Whistleblower. And uh, I'll go ahead and see you guys in the next video. See you guys there.